Y'all give it up for Gene in the Comedy Core one time. Woo! What's up, Comedy Core? Tim Lowe in the house, where's Tim Lowe? At the bar. In here, all right. Oh shit, that's Tim Lowe. Tim Lowe looks like John Belushi let himself go. Yeah. I like that goose gossip stash, that shit is looking good. Politics can suck a big bag of dicks. You know what I mean? Everyone out here carrying on about a witch hunt. Is it a witch hunt? Isn't it a witch hunt? Is it a witch hunt? For all this Russian collusion nonsense, I thought a witch hunt was when Hillary went, nah, I better not fuck with the Clintons. We're gonna end up this way. <laughs> you know what I mean? Get disappeared and shit. Where'd that pool go? The other day, this gal I was out with her. She goes, do you think I should get this purse? It's totes cute, right? I'm adorable. I was like, bitch, you've been eating ramen for a month. Do you think you should get that purse? <laughs> what kind of common core arithmetic is this world coming to? <laughs> common core is like taking three left hand turns instead of a right. So I can just, you just get your numbers right. <laughs> Y'all hear President Trump got hurt a little while back, a couple weeks ago, me Golf. Pulled the muscle. <laughs> that reminds me of when Clinton was in office. You know, that guy was pulling his muscle all the time. <laughs> Sometimes getting people to pull it for him. Y'all hear about the whale sightings down the Jersey Shore? Y'all heard Remember back in the day that was just called local summer? <laughs> right, all the heifers would come out when everyone left town. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking blocking the sun and shit. <laughs> Y'all hear Elizabeth Warren said, I'm not afraid. <laughs> I think we can add that to the list of things she is not. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like Native American. <laughs> Are gonna be president. <laughs> How you feeling, Gene? You feeling all right? Feeling good. Good, man. I'm glad you're back. I missed you, man. Yeah, I'm feeling good. Do my physical therapy on there, man. Yeah, stay after it, man. Stay healthy. Y'all know when I heard about a double bypass, I thought for certain it'd be about Carl. Is there anything left to boycott? <laughs> Is everything ruined? Is everyone fucking happy now? Bunch of cry babies. Where's my man, the Count of Monte Cristo back there? I'm with you, man. <laughs> right in the fucking millennials, god damn it. <laughs> you know, I got into this stand-up racket about five, almost six months ago now. So I watched some of my favorite comics, some of the greats, become mediocre at best. <laughs> you know, I mean, no one thinks independently no more. No one writes intelligently no more. Everyone's got 15 minutes worth of Trump is a dookie head. Hardy fucking hard. <laughs> fucking low hanging fruit. Somebody write something smart for it. Right, every goddamn thing's offensive. Right, you can't call a felon a felon no more. He ain't a criminal. He's a justice involved person. <laughs> uh, fucking kidding me. God forbid you call the 13th grade a freshman. No, you can't say that one either. You gotta call him the fresh more. <laughs> Fuck out of here. At least that's the same amount of syllables. What about manhole? You gotta call it maintenance whole cover. You fucking kidding me. Think there's gonna be a clash action suit for all the time we've lost with all these extra syllables? <laughs> you notice the only one they ain't changing is semen? Right? They still guzzling that down by the bucket hole. <laughs> Just give me all of it, give me all you can. They're changing every other goddamn room. Not a peep about the semen. Not a whisper. Y'all hear about these food cubbies? You know, somebody heard about a food cubby. These little plastic things that you put on your plate 
so that your food don't touch your other food. What? I swear to God, it's called a food cubby. It's 1999, about 2 o'clock in the morning with the guy that sells the shit that he sticks to the raft. And that guy, <laughs> a food cubby, $19, so your peas don't touch your fucking mashed potatoes. The fuck is this world coming to? You get two if you pay the extra Yeah, I think you got free shipping on the second. Uh, <laughs> 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 Want to forgive college loans? That's another class action waiting to happen. All the people who are responsible and paying their shit off. Huh? Are they going to undo all the blowjobs I had to give? Just to make oh. College was expensive. <laughs> Some of us didn't major in basket weaving. Theory. <laughs> Theory. <laughs> that word makes sense. Right? <laughs> I try not to, man. <laughs> Y'all want to know my take on cancel culture? If somebody says something that you don't like, change the fucking channel. There's 1,500 fucking channels now. Go find something that makes you happy. You know what I mean? Fucking everybody looking for something to make them miserable these days. I don't get it. Fucking swipe the other direction. I don't know how it works no more, Gene. I'm getting old. <laughs> <laughs> Gee, you know my man out in LA, my homeboy, he locked it up. He married Miss America, Miss US of A. This gal's out of this world. She's smart and funny, gorgeous. She was runner up Miss Universe. You know, so at least he left that window open for me to one up him. <laughs> I got a shot. You know what I'm, saying? I'm saying, Miss Universe, if you're out there, holla at me, man. I clean up all right. I clean up all right. Nah, it's off the charts as this gal is. She's the one who won the lottery. Happy birthday, Coco! Yeah, my man. I've been hiding out for about 10 years now. I ain't seen him in 10 years. But I'm about to make a comeback, so it's deep book. Nia, I love y'all. Comedy Cove, I love you guys. Good night. Yeah.